Hi, Tim Roberts, Application Engineer with Go Engineer. This quick tip video, I'm going to show you the tool rules of fielding surfaces. So the first tip, if you did not know, is that we can fill it a surface. <clears throat> it's just the standard fillet tool. You can find it here. You can also find it in, under the surfaces um, group of tools. Um, for a knit surface, you know, a single piece surface, we will use the regular fillet. So this is all one piece. So regular fillet, I'll go to, you know, just this constant size fillet and we'll put in a five millimeter fillet on our sharp corners here and that works just fine on a single surface. Now once you have a, a group of more than one surface, for example, let's look at another part here that has two surface bodies surface A and surface B, um, the regular fillet will no longer work on this. So our secret to doing a fillet is to use something called the face fillet. Uh, it appears over here in number three, and when you do that, you've got two different surface sets you can select from. So I'll select surface A and surface B, and if you think about it, there are four different mathematical ways to create this fillet and it's going to trim away the surfaces. So I can toggle my direction until I get the fillet located where I want and when I apply this it will actually trim out the surfaces and knit them together. So uh, that is how you fillet a surface when you've got two surfaces and they're not knit together. So those are the fundamental rules. Let me show you again. Uh, if the surfaces are knit, use a regular fillet. And if the surfaces are not knit, use a face fillet. Keep in mind, your result will be knit afterwards, and you'll have a single piece. Thanks for watching this quick tip video. My name is Tim Roberts.